it's used to make to um, quell a uh, four-acre brush fire on Creek Road. Um, there's a lot of fire companies involved. I have more pictures and uh, even a video somebody submitted online on my on the .com website, so you can see it there. Uh, Firefighters said about they had to make six drops of water, more than six drops of water, to stop the fire. A lot of fire companies were there. They were there for about three or four hours to extinguish the fire. Um, Tamaka's Rabbit Run. The dam is also two days today. And I'm going to go with some details on that. Since, since, just since, because we're here. Yeah, Kathleen Quinn Farber, she, uh, a fellow reporter for the uh, Tamaka website, she had done some pictures already online. So, uh, bear with me here. I'm using small print, so it's hard to see here, so you got to bear with me here. All right, well, let's, hold on a second here. Like it's a two-day, Rabbit Run's a two-day event. Um, today is the second day, obviously. It's a, um, I guess they call it a button day today, right? A button yeah. day. So you, you, you buy a button, but it's also a membership drive. Uh, trophies today will be given to the largest fish for both male and female, and for the first limit for both male and female. And, and the, the winner will receive a, um, a drift boat trip and two-night stay to Bolesky, New York, beyond the Salmon River. I'm guessing Tom Benatelli donated that. But 6 o'clock, it's over at 6 o'clock, and right now it's around uh, just, just before 11. So if you're watching this, come out and, and fish. Mary, the Mary D. Fire Company, uh, they're having their last breakfast at the Mary D. Fire Company, and that ends today um, around noon, I think, if I recall. At noon, noon. So you got an hour, so if you want to go eat some breakfast, go over to Mary D. Uh, today is also the hometown craft show at the hometown farmer's market. That lasts till 4 p.m. today. I heard it, I'm going to head up there afterwards. I hear there's a lot of people, a lot of people up there. Today is also the third annual spring fling at the Strand Roller Link in McAdoo. That goes from 10 to 5. Vendor, crafters, flea market, entertainment, live performances, demonstrations, admission is free. Also today um, in Carbon County, the Carbon County Home Business and Ex Outdoor Expo, that's at the Jim Thorpe Memorial Hall, and that's located on 10th Street in Jim, East 10th Street in Jim Thorpe. That lasts till 4 p.m. today. Um, the Coldale Fire Company is having their uh, annual Chinese theme basket auction and bake sale. Um, the browsing starts around 12 o'clock. Um, the actual auction uh, begins at 3 o'clock. They have a lot of good prizes, a lot. Every year they have, a, so it's definitely worth stopping. There isn't much else going on around 12 o'clock, so it just makes you head up to the fire company um, between 12 and 3. Um, also, um, today's the last performance of Miracle Worker, Miracle Worker at the Strawberry Playhouse in Tuscarora. That's at 2 o'clock. I was at that last, there, um, a Saturday showing. Oh, they were awesome. Really awesome. Re really worth showing. Today, the biggest event today, I'm guessing, I get, in addition to the uh, Derby here, is the um, hold on a second, the Hunger Walk. That's being held via the Tamako Area Faith Fellowship Network. Um, that, that'll kick off uh, right at 2 o'clock at the St. Luke's parking lot on um, South Street. Um, South, sorry, South. Don't mind me, I just woke up. <laughs> uh, uh, South Railroad Street. Not the one up near uh, the old family dollar, the other one, the old family practice. So be, be there for that. That's two o'clock. Doesn't cost anything. You give a donation of a canned item, anything like that. After the uh, hunger, hunger walk, uh, there's an ice cream afterward, free ice cream at the Zion Church. I'm sponsoring that. Uh, there's also today, I guess one of the last things today would be the coffee house featuring Sterling Cook duo at the Creative Changes Center for Arts and Humanities in Brockton. So that's a free admission. Doesn't cost anything. You can give a donation if you want. The center, they do a lot out there for the center, very nice. I guess over the weekend, over the weekend yesterday, um, my buddy and Judy and all them, they, they held a uh, fundraiser for the American Cancer Society. Actually, yesterday was a two-day, uh, a two-event day for them. Um, and for the, for, they started off selling, uh, I forget what they called it on a thing. They, they had a Chinese auction fundraisers, food and everything in the morning at the community art center. Later on in the day, they had entertainment. So um, I'll have some inf uh, photos and video online uh, later on that as well. Yesterday, also at the gym uh, at the Machunka State Park, uh, Sergeant Major of the Army was there. Believe it or not, the high, that's the highest-ranking official in the Army, in the United States Army. He's actually Palmerton native, so I took video and photos, photos of that as well. That'll be on my website in the next in the next day or so. I only slept a couple hours in a few days, so it's going to take me a few days to get caught up with everything. It's a pretty eventful weekend. Um, what else happened? I also, I put pictures online of the uh, spring fling held via the uh, teachers and, and parents of the Rush Elementary School. 
So that was pretty eventful. A lot of good. And um, Sipco uh, DJ was also uh, help, help with that as well. Also last night was Tamako's uh, senior prom. So let me, let me just go over the events again for uh, next week. As of right now, I don't seem like it's that eventful compared to this week, believe it or not. Okay, so tomorrow, uh, Monday, May 4th, is auditions for Blythe Spirit at the Strawberry Playhouse. Um, I have done 6.30 6 30, 6 as the uh, time, but I would go on their uh, Facebook page to verify that, because I, I couldn't find the time. Also, West Penn Township Super Supervisor Meeting is also tomorrow at their building, of course, at 7 o'clock. On Tuesday, there's a radioactive radio radon, the Invisible Killer presentation. That's being held via the Tamaka Chamber of Commerce, and BEC, and um, Sites Brothers. And that's um, at the Altri C, and that starts around 8 o'clock in the morning. It's an early, early one. So what else is going on that day? Bur uh, Tamaka Borough Council meeting is also on Tuesday. That's at 7 o'clock. Of course, show up. I've got to mention there's a burn ban. Uh, in effect, that, that, that ends this month on the 17th, so no burning. What else, what else we got going on? Uh, Gene Morrison is performing at the Vaughn's Restaurant, the train station, on Wednesday in Tamaqua, obviously. Uh, Thursday is the National Day of Prayer via the BE Bethany ECC. That's being held at, outside the Bur Borough Hall, the flagpole, on this Thursday, May 7th at 12 o'clock. So I, I usually go to that just to take some pictures and stuff. Let's figure going on. Local stuff. Friday, there's a um, the Skookie Night Away is having a I guess a, a memorial day of caring and support of Captain Jason Jones. A lot of frogs here. <laughs> you want to hold the frog up in the camera so you can see the frog? Everywhere I look, there's frogs. <laughs> Let me zoom in so you can see I here. I forgot your name. Repeat on me. Andy. Andy. There you go. Yeah. Thank you. Appreciate that. There's a lot of frogs here. <laughs> They're all over the place. Oh, thank you. You know, you got a frog too. He has one too. Oh, that's okay. Let's still say hi then. <laughs> thank you. I'll take pictures afterwards. I'm gonna get, get, finish the video, then I'm wrapping up. You can probably hear the frogs in the background. There's a lot of them. Also, this this Saturday is the community picnic at the Lehighton Park. This coming Saturday, obviously. Community picnic at the Lehighton Park in Lehighton. That's from 2 till 6. That's a big event. Thanks. Also, we have... What else is going on? Yeah. They're, they're, uh, the Legends Oldies Band is being held um, this coming Saturday at the Tamaka Community Arts Center. And that's from 6 to six to 8. The Tamaka Salvation Army, there's a teen dance um, being held via DJ Frank. Thank you for... And that's a Saturday from 7 till 10. I've got to mention, we need volunteers. We need people to stand up and help at the, the Salvation Army. Uh, our open gyms, the only, only one that's there is, is our major. So we need uh, more volunteers, two people. Um, we'll pay for, for the background check, criminal check. But if you can help out, give me a call, 668-1234, uh, uh, or on Salvation Army, 668-0410. All you have to do is give an hour a week, you know what I mean? And it helps. Imagine all, the, all the kids off the street, they can just go inside the gym, play basketball, all that kind of stuff. So need volunteers, please give us a call. So there's a lot of breakfasts next Sunday too, for a fire company breakfast. But you go to tomacoair.com website, you see all the information. Like I said, if you look on the right hand side of the website, you'll see all the events listed in a, uh, in a list format. You can click on the, the menu, the month tab, and you view the whole month. There's a lot of stuff going on in a, in a month. So you can also um, page down further and see all the posters on there. Um, so if you want to submit a tip or have not see news happening, um, either text it to 570-668-1234, which is a cell phone, believe it or not, or um, text it to newstip at tamaquaarea.com. So um, thank you very much. Remember to support your local nonprofits to include uh, these functions here, uh, local businesses, and volunteer. Thank you.